What's up guys, it is finally official. SpaceX is targeting the third week of April for the maiden Starship test flight mission. I already told you this, the license is not ready yet, as mentioned in the tweet. Exactly as I expected, they will do a final wet dress rehearsal next week, April 11 to be precise. The road closure on the 10th has been cancelled already, and one week later, which collides with our speculated date, on the 17th of April, they will attempt to launch the Starship. But I kinda like to see it on 420th. Elon might want it too. For the vehicle, both booster quick disconnect and ship quick disconnect are already connected to the rocket. Works at the Florida Starship launch site seem to be slowed down a bit but it shows progress. The new Star Factory looks to be completed. It is a sleek and beautiful building. These stranded tower segments just don't know what to do at the moment. They are just patiently waiting to be transported to their destination. At the launch pad, SpaceX has started the installation of subcoolers as part of the upcoming orbital tank farm for Starship. Once they have a fully working design of the orbital launch mount at Starbase, I am 100% sure they will swiftly install the orbital launch table here. I think we have talked about this slowed down work at Pad 39A. The orbital launch mount is a totally new system and it hasn't launched any super heavy booster till date. So, they might want to collect data from the first orbital flight and make necessary changes if need be and replicate the same here in Florida. I don't know if that makes sense but it makes sense to me. What do you think? Thanks for watching this short update. I will keep you updated with any new development. Just hit the subscribe button. That is it for now.